Hi, my name's Judith Turner. You know, I was just uh, sewing before and uh, the bulb on my sewing machine exploded. And I thought this is probably a good opportunity to show you how to fix a broken bulb. It's extremely important to be safe. So un turn the machine off and unplug the cord. The bulb exploded and that means that the uh, section, the bayonet section, is still inside. All machines are different. Mine's a Janome and it opens quite easily. You may have to unscrew the section to get at it. Um, so I can only go on what a Janome is, but most of them are pretty much the same. There's a bracket that actually holds the light fitting in place and you're in, you need to remove that. The screws generally can either be with a flat screwdriver or with a Phillips head. I'm using a Phillips head and when I put it all back together I'll use the flat head just to show you that you can use both. Once the plate's removed, uh, you can lift the uh, socket out slightly towards you and there's another screw that you want to undo which will uh, split it in half. So this particular um, design that I'm doing, it's got a screw and at the end of it there's a nut and so as it unscrews the nut's coming off as well. Um, unfortunately one side of my, um, my lamp is missing the screw and the nut so perhaps that's a reason why this happened. So once you separate the casing um, the balance of the bulb just comes out quite easily and now it's just a matter of putting it all back together. The hardest um, bit was to actually put the um, nut back in and the screw and just uh, keeping those together. So it's a little bit fiddly but um, it saves you um, packing up the machine and taking it down to a sewing machine shop and getting them to do it. I try and uh, have spare bulbs um, at all times just in case so I do recommend that you do that as well. I spoke with my sewing machine provider because I had actually only purchased these bulbs a matter of weeks before and uh, what she said was that the quality of them now, that, that the ones that are coming through, that um, the quality is just not there and what she did suggest is that I look at the new um, halogen bulb so i am got some of those on order and apparently they last longer, they get, give off a better light, um, so I won't have the same problem. You might want to talk to your provider and see if uh, they have anything similar. So you can see that it's actually not a really difficult thing to do. Um, the first time you may find um, it takes a little bit longer because you're getting used to, to how everything works but um, all I really had to do was undo um, four screws to get that metal plate off and then one or two screws you should have to undo the casing that holds the bulb and then you can release it and then just secure that again and then it's just a matter of putting in the new bulb hopefully this one will last more than two weeks although I'll have the new halogen ones coming and then um, all I'm going to do is plug the machine back in, turn the light on and we're back working. I hope that um, helps you and saves you a little bit of money. Happy altering!